the 25th of February is actually the date who got, say, yeah, a druggy which began, yeah? A druggy with passion, a druggy with love, a druggy I could do every single day, yeah? The day I started with my first video of Fortnite, where I actually fell in love with the druggy of Fortnite, where I could play Fortnite every single day. If I ask myself, at this age, 16, almost 17, do my 13 years old back then, how much do you love Fortnite? How much do you like to compete in Fortnite? My 13 years old self would say a lot, 100% a lot. To actually like reverse this story into a like personal story about myself, I was actually born with a lot of natural competitiveness. I always tried to compete in games. My dad introduced me to games and I already instantly played for a lot of competing and getting better. Yeah, that is what I got to say by far. By the years, I've learned a lot of new people, yeah? A lot of new people, a lot of new like uh, ways to compete, ways to learn how to play Fortnite. And I always wanted to take this as far as I could. What is my end goal actually? I think it has always been becoming a professional player. I have built an insane amount of discipline. An insane amount of discipline of training every single day. Mechanics, aim, game sense, everything. Everything you could think of, yeah? It's insane. Whilst many people like focus on their instinct motivation of actually just enjoying it and doing it by that, I went really extreme by discipline every single day. With some instinct motivation. Because when my first video came out, I had a pure, pure love, pure feeling with instinct motivation. Fortnite. That feeling of the love with Fortnite has passed all the way down. All the way down until this moment where I have zero instinct motivation. Zero. When I stream, you don't see me really happy. You don't see me really happy to stream for that. And at this moment, I'm just gonna say, I'm sorry for disappointing you guys. I'm going to quit for that. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. But I'm not gonna play Fortnite anymore. I don't have to love with playing Fortnite anymore. And it's all you guys know me about. You don't know me by anything else. You know me by playing Fortnite. Yeah, I do YouTube since 2017, but not Fortnite since then. But since 2019, you guys know me for Fortnite. I'm not going to play Fortnite anymore. I'm sorry. Maybe a few videos, but not Fortnite anymore. I am officially quitting Fortnite by now and I'll continue playing Valorant, yeah? I recently started to play Valorant. I enjoy this way uh, way more. I just feel way more welcome in the community. I feel way more challenged. I feel way more like instinct motivation of actually playing this game. I feel like enjoying to compete again. I actually really enjoy the, the competitiveness again, you know? Because even though a lot of people have taught me in my latest video, late, not my latest video, but my as it was Fortnite montage, wow, you look so, so tired of this game, yeah? I could by myself say that as it was montage was the last montage I genuinely enjoyed Fortnite. After that, all my passion slowly, slowly died. At the moment I made the SA Was montage, it was genuinely the last moment I enjoyed Fortnite. Genuinely. At these moments, I just feel really bad playing Fortnite. I feel like I'm, I'm just mentally hurting myself. I feel like I'm, I'm doing not the, wrong, the right, right thing. It, it, it just feels like I'm just mentally like, torturing myself. I feel like, um, for what am I doing this? That's a question I ask myself a lot. For what am I doing this? I, 
I don't feel free anymore. I don't feel really free playing this game. I don't feel really enjoying Ross playing this game. You know, I have played this game for a long time, yeah? I've played this since it released. An insane amount of time, I could tell, by how long I've been playing this game. But I'm just not enjoying it anymore. I don't want to talk too long about this, but I generally don't enjoy the game anymore. And I think I've put a lot of time in this, and it's time to say goodbye. It's time to welcome Valorant, it's time to welcome a new close. Yes, new chapter, new me. This will also mean that I'll be leaving my Valor team, the team I'm a part of right now. I want to personally thank Falor for welcoming me as a uh, player in the team, as a Fortnite player, but they are not able to help me as a Valorant player. Unfortunate. They, I just want to thank the mental coach Jess, he helped me out a lot, everyone in the team helped me out a lot, and I just don't feel, don't feel like ment mentally happy in this game anymore. So. I'm not gonna finish it with this video. I'm sorry. I don't want to play this game anymore. I hope I don't disappoint you guys. But this is the end of a chapter. The chapter of Fortnite has ended. The chapter of Valorant will begin. Thank you guys for understanding. Have a nice day. Peace out.